Have you ever wondered how Gon was able to transform into one of the most powerful beings in all of anime? Well, the key to unlocking this mystery comes from the depths of human emotions and the journey that Gon undertakes in Hunter x Hunter, from the relentless pursuit of his elusive father to the heart-wrenching loss of his surrogate mentor, which revealed the delicate nature of how human emotions impact the potent force of Nen, which culminates in a climactic confrontation of Pito and Gon which forever changes the trajectory of Gon's life. This is a point where emotions are not just felt but wielded as a force of change. In Hunter x Hunter, we may know Gon as this happy-go-lucky kid, but we learn later on in the series the tragedy that he beholds within him. This all stems from Gon's fatherly void. Gon's unwavering pursuit for Ging transcends a mere search for a parent. It's a quest for identity and belonging. As Gon faces trials and tribulations, the void left by his absent father transforms him into a haunting presence. His yearning for connection intensifies, accentuating feelings of abandonment and inadequacy, creating an emotional charged landscape that demands our attention. That may be where his tragedy stems, but it really Really starts to be released when he meets Kite, his mentor and surrogate father, that stands as a bastion of stability in Gon's tumultuous world. When Pito ruthlessly snuffs out Kite's life, the emotional anchor Gon clings to is violently severed. This loss triggers a descent into darkness, a metamorphosis fueled by Gon's unresolved parental struggles and frustrations as he's unable to protect those who he holds dear. The transformation is so deep that Gon's initial kindness immediately breaks as a storm of deep-seated anger replaces where it was once stood. Now in the world of Hunter x Hunter, Nen becomes an intimate mirror reflecting one's emotions. In the Chimera arc, Gon's explosive powers surge in the confrontation with Pito in such a visceral manifestation of his internal turmoil. His Nen, once a conduit for optimism, morphs into a formidable force, mirroring the chaos within. As Gon confronts Pito, the sacrificial choices emerge as a desperate attempt to regain control of the uncontrollable. The willingness to sacrifice his life and expend all his Nen becomes only too clear. Now in this this moment, Gon starts to transcend anime history and become one of the strongest characters in anime. However, we also get to see a massive display of his internal emotions in the fight itself, in the backdrops. Amidst the clash between Gon and Pito, the battlefield serves as a tragic canvas where emotions unfold like a captivating symphony. Each strike and parry not only showcases physical prowess, but also a result of profound grief and despair all within Gon's heart. The desolate landscape becomes a mass reflection of his bleak emotions and every unleashed Nen surge acts as a release for his heart that is tragically broken. We also get to see how this breaks Killua's heart, the one witness to this intense manifestation of Gon's hatred. While Gon's emotional turmoil unfolds, his closest friend Killua is compelled to witness the metamorphosis of the once kind and optimistic Gon turn into a vessel of unchecked rage and grief. For Killua, who has always admired Gon's purity, the sight of his friend's descent into darkness is shattering. The weight of the helplessness bears down on Killua as he witnesses Gon grapple with the void left by his father and the lost of Kite. Now in the battle, tainted by the ominous aura of the impending conflict becomes a living canvas for the climax of Gon's emotional journey. Each step towards Pito echoes Gon's grief and determination, transforming the once serene landscape into a reflection of his inner storm. The aftermath leaves Gon physically altered and spent standing as a testament to the profound cost of unchecked emotions. The ensuing silence becomes a powerful punctuation, underscoring the irreversible change in both Gon and the narrative arc itself.